वेलकम बैक टू आवर मैथमेटिक्स सेशन नंबर सिस्टम इन दिस एपिसोड ऑफ नंबर सिस्टम्स वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट रिप्रेजेंटिंग रियल नंबर्स ऑन द नंबर लाइन Every real number is represented by a unique point on the number line. Further, every point on the number line represents one and only one real number. Real number is a big number system. So we are going to visualize the numbers on the number line through a magnifying glass. And the process of visualization of representation of numbers on the number line through a magnifying glass is called as a process of successive magnification. Let's take an example for the visualization of representing 2.65 on the number line. To locate 2.65, we first focus between 2 and 3 on the number line, as we are aware that it lies between 2 and 3. Again, by dividing the number line into 10 subdivisions, we focus between 2.6 and 2.7. Again, repeating the same process by dividing the number line into 10 subdivisions. we locate 2.65 on the number line between 2.6 and 2.7 this process is called as the process of successive magnification we can proceed endlessly in the same manner successively viewing through a magnifying glass to locate any real number the same procedure can be used to visualize a real number with a non terminating non recurring decimal expansion on the number line The first question in exercise 1.4 is visualize 3.765 on the number line using successive magnification. Since we are aware 3.765 lies between 3 and 4 in the number line, we focus between 3 and 4. To get a more accurate visualization of the representation, we again divide the number line into 10 subdivisions between 3 and 4 and use a magnifying glass To focus the number between 3.7 and 3.8. Repeating the same process by dividing the number line into 10 subdivisions between 3.7 and 3.8, we focus the given number between 3.76 and 3.77. And finally, again dividing the number line into 10 subdivisions, we visualize the given number 3.765 between 3.76 and 3.77. The second question is. Visualize 4.26 bar on the number line up to four decimal places. The given number 4.26 bar could be written as 4.2626 and so on. Since it is up to four decimal places, we are going to locate 4.2626 on the number line. We are now sure that the given number 4.2626 lies between four and five, and so we are going to focus the magnifying glass between four and five. For accurate visualization of the representation, we again divide the number line into 10 subdivisions between 4 and 5 and use a magnifying glass to focus the given number between 4.2 and 4.3. Repeating the same process by dividing the number line into 10 subdivisions between 4.2 and 4.3, we focus the given number between 4.26 and 4.27. Further dividing the number line into 10 subdivisions, we visualize the given number between 4.262 and 4.263. Finally, dividing the number line into 10 subdivisions, we visualize the given number 4.2626 between 4.262 and 